this is Jeff Dumbarello, uh, director of the Southwest Florida RIA, here to talk to you about the Lee County, Florida, June 2011 backlogged foreclosure trends. Uh, the clerk's office puts out this report. If you've never been to their website, go to leeclerk.org. It's an amazing resource of information if you're doing business in Lee County, Florida. We're, we're very blessed to be able to get the amount of information that we get out of there. All of our foreclosure analysis is done via free download and it exports directly into Excel and CVS format. As of June 30th, 2011, we had 6,449 active cases. That's a sharp decline from where we were. Uh, peak was just over 25,000 and you can look and see where we are. And uh, We, we, we kind of hit a valley uh, to the right side of the uh, peak and then it's been pretty, uh, we've been doing a lot of disposure of this trend since about January of 2010. So it's interesting, uh, on the streets you hear all about shadow inventory and this and that and this, but this represents what's really coming to market. I mean, it, it, I'm not finding much evidence in public records of lenders foreclosing and not putting on the market. Yes, some select assets are held off. I know of a development in Lehigh Acres. Uh, I know of a couple houses in Captiva, a couple houses in Sanibel. There's a couple houses here and there, but as far as a mass block of inventory, I, I, we, I really don't see it. And on top of that, the institutions aren't going to act all at once. Now, uh, percentage of cleared cases, you can look and see this year we've been disposing of a tremendous amount of cases. June, we, had, we cleared 321% of the new filings. That's the lowest clearance rate we've had. Now, for the layman, for every Liz pendants they filed, we cleared 3.2 cases. So it's it's kind of hard to see that the uh, this is going to go on forever. Particularly, what what a lot of people aren't putting in the equation are the cash sales. I mean, year to date, we're at almost 73% cash sales. Last year, uh, we were year to date. I want to say 72. The year before that was 64.5. With that much cash coming into the market, it's broken the negative feedback loop. When when you don't have a lot of new mortgages to foreclose upon, the negative feedback loop uh, gets broken. Here to talk about an event we have, which is tomorrow, July the 7th. It's our Southwest Florida Rio luncheon. I'm going to be doing a market update, 2011 versus 2010. And what we're going to talk about is what, what areas of Lee County are more money moving through this year than last year. Uh, what areas are prices going up, what area prices going down, and what markets are selling more traditional property than distressed property. Uh, this meeting is at the Edison on McGregor Boulevard. Uh, for RIA members, the cost is your lunch only. For non-members, it's $5 plus the cost of your lunch. Uh, if you get the chance, uh, email me, jeff at swflreia.com to, uh, to RSVP. Thanks for watching this video.